Hello, hello. This video is for women leaders who work within male-dominated industries. You're joining us for our two-minute leadership tip of the day, leading through crisis and chaos. Today's tip is about screen time. No, not the screen time for kids. The screen time for adults, you know, how much time we're spending on these things. Well, over the past week, I received my screen report and I realized that I quite frankly was ashamed at how my screen time went unchecked and how for the past six weeks, my screen time has been drastically increasing. Between conference calls and video conference calls, my phone has been a main staple now that I'm working from home and the lines between work and home have been completely thrown out the window. So what I have begun to do to reinforce having a decreased screen time and to be in my new rhythm of working from home, I've decided that all meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks in between is going to be my cue to put down the phone, to push away from the laptop, and to actually get some time away from the screen. In addition to that, I have went back to some of my best practices of eliminating notifications from my devices. That way I am not triggered to pick it up every time I see an alert or a ding because you know you go down a rabbit hole once you start responding to the alerts. So all of the alerts are off my phone, again, as a best practice to decrease the screen time so that I can stay in the rhythm of working at a highly productive level and contributing to the Zero Gap organization at a high level. So I hope that this tip inspires you to be mindful of how you are spending time on your smart devices as well, and some tips for you to unplug throughout the day. Now, until next time, continue to emulate excellence and eliminate excuses. My name is Jacqueline Twilley, president at ZeroGap.co. Oh, if you forgot, to watch part of this series, it's a daily series, you can get all of the previous videos for free. Just click the link below.